In the north of Brittany, they think that they are the most attractive coastline in the whole of Europe. But not only that, it is believed that the Bretons are the most skillful seamen and fishermen in France. This is Léal, the wonderful covered market of Dinar. We are in a small town here of 6,000 people and look at this incredible display of freshness, of quality. Look at this sea spider. You see, it is just incredible. Now here, this is my favorite food in the world. So I get very excited about it. And what is so pleasing is that nothing has been cooked and people are going to take that home, cooked it simply, and it is a feast. If you are just a visitor, you won't miss out on this seafood treat as Breton chefs get the very best from the local fishermen. And this selection fit for a king is for my table. Le plateau de fruits de mer, the seafood platter, this is the dish that I look forward to most when I come back to France every year. And usually you can find that in most restaurants on the seaside and especially in the brasseries. There are two stars amongst the wonderful display of vegetables in Brittany and that is the cauliflower and the artichokes. Almost everybody grow them in their garden. It is prepared very simply. Artichokes are usually boiled and served with a vinaigrette. And then the cauliflower, very much like in Australia, it is served with a white sauce. It is eaten raw, it is eaten with mayonnaise or in a salad. Because Breton cuisine is inspired by both land and sea, these campy artichoke and cauliflower crepes are a magnificent example of the local fare. I first mix together a little plain flour, one egg, salt, pepper and milk until smooth, and rest the mixture for about 30 minutes. Then I mix a little melted butter and some chives. In France, every household has a crepe pan, and mine is non-stick, so cooking crepe is easy. The freshness and the quality of the ingredients are very important in this crepe dish, but ultimately what will make the difference is the thinness of the crepe. For the sauce, I beat a little egg yolk with a little water over a bath of hot water until light. Then I whisk in a little melted butter bit by bit, season with a few drops of lemon juice and fold in a little whipped cream. This is called a sauce mousseline. In a little butter, I reheat some steamed cauliflower florets and artichokes. Then add in some freshly cooked scampi and snip chives. I garnish each crepe with a few scampi and vegetables, add a little muslin sauce and fold each crepe neatly. The flavor of Brittany trapped in a crepe. It smells wonderful and tastes even better. This is Normandy and tomorrow I'm looking forward to testing one of my favorite liqueurs, Calvados. <laughs>